special ministers, if you're going in somebody's constraints, you must inform him or her in advance. Yes. I want to really confirm that that weekend, which she's talking about, I was in Eastern Uganda, I was in Bali. She came with a helicopter, she jumped, I think, from in Maruku, went to, again, of course they just jump, these ones, they just jump. <laughs> then went to Namisindwa. Honorable, Honorable Nathan, <laughs> this is the Prime Minister of Uganda, she did not jump. Mad Madam Speaker, you're right. You're right. I don't know how, what it happens in helicopters. Me, I thought they jump, but if they do something and, else... Because you don't know what happens and you, don't, you yes, have so never I, used I, them. Yes, so, so. so, Madam Speaker... Order. Order. Right Honourable... Right Honourable Speaker. Honourable colleagues can bear me witness. I have been moving in all parts of this country, including his area. I've always informed the members in advance. Even that day, I had 16 members of parliament from Bugisu in a meeting. That honorable speaker, I respect members of parliament. And I have always respected my brother. Whenever, when I was appointed here Minister of Health, he abused me. When I, I used to stand up to speak when I was a new person, he used to abuse me. Is he in order for him to continue even now when I'm a prime minister of this country? Ever since we won, the ministries concerned have never done whatever they are supposed to do. And this is in line with our national objective enshrined in Objective 23 of the Constitution of this country. My prayer, therefore, is that the Ministry of Disaster especially visits these places with the looming danger. And especially, you know, Madam Speaker, with landslides, they warn. God is very good. They warn fast. The cracks, you see them gaping and becoming larger. And for now, it is worse. So I want my prayer to the ministry, one, to expedite the issue of Bonambotier resettlement. Secondly, to also establish evacuation camps, if possible, so that in the case of any emergence of a disaster, people can be evacuated to such safe places. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Honorable Musila, report. I was in that area on instruction from the president. We vividly saw the crack and we saw people who were hanging in the cliffs. We also have a plan.